hi guys and welcome to a new vlog I was a bit emotional earlier because it was the last time I left the salon I'm just I've packed everything I've just got a few things in there I've got to drive to Brisbane to drop off the MG car um, yeah, I've got my makeup kit with me. I've got my carry-on. I've prepared like a chicken salad, but I'll show you guys that on the plane. And I've just got some keto snacks in there just because I hate plain food. I just had um, a chicken salad just before, but I'm ready. Look at me and my post crying face. I am fucking ready. I had a cry. That's all been done. I'm just gonna have a little bit of the um, coconut yogurt that I have left because you can't waste coconut yogurt. So yeah, I am excited, nervous, scared, like so many thoughts running through my head, but mostly obviously excited to see Peter. I haven't seen him in over five weeks. This is one of the longest times, apart from I think a seven week block, we haven't seen each other. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited about that more than anything. Um, and yeah, I need to go and chuck all my shit in my car. So I will probably speak to you guys when I'm at the airport. Hey guys, so I'm at the airport a bit early. I went and dropped off my car, the MG um, in Brisbane. The reason why I haven't posted about my review yet is because I'm working with them. They have to approve everything that I upload. So that's why it's taking a while, but um, I actually ended up really liking the car, but I'm sure you'll see that on my Instagram coming soon but um yeah i just wanted to show you guys what i packed food wise um with me because i don't eat plain food don't eat plain snacks the only thing that i would eat is um cheese from the cheese and crackers or i'll have a pepsi max so i did actually pack I'm trying not to get people in it so i packed my little I just pretty much packed all the food that's going to go off. Um, I packed a no-shoe donut, one of these, so I probably won't eat it. Got a little Vitaworks white chocolate. And then I had this, it's just like double smoked ham. Um, I haven't even opened it, but I made myself this information is the most scarce. So earlier this morning, I did actually um, make some chicken and salad. So there's just lettuce, tomato, onions, chicken, and parmesan. And then I've got this dressing that I'll put on top. To be honest, I had the same thing for lunch. And I don't really feel like it, so I probably won't even eat it, but in case I get hungry. Good morning, Perth. Today's the day where I go and see my house for the first time being a house owner. I haven't actually seen it because Peter's been organizing it all with the keys. I'm wearing the new Amen plum set and it's so comfortable. I'm wearing a size small, um, Code Jazz 10. Um, but what we're gonna do today is, cause we did a little bit of um, shopping for like the kitchen and just like essentials, I guess, before I left to Perth. So we've got a few boxes of like glasses, cutlery. What else did I buy? like food i ordered some stuff off iherb supplements i'll show you guys actually that'd be way easier so we've just got a few boxes of stuff i also got this mug today from glass half full how cute is it it's got my little leopard print design some mugs from kmart i'll show you guys this when i unpack though tripod that's all Peter's tools. Yeah, you can't really see what's in there yet. But Peter's just gonna bring his car from the garage over and we're gonna pack his car and then we're gonna go to the house, drop off that and then we've gotta go shop for a bed base. I did order um, a couch, a bed base and two mattresses from Koala. Um, which actually arrived yesterday, so I'm gonna chuck my camera on a tripod and show you guys how easy that is to assemble. Peter's here. Let's do this. Okay, we're off. Off to dump the first load of stuff. Apparently the couch is only supposed to take four minutes. 
from start to finish, Peter. Cool, we'll see about Do you reckon that. we can do that? 37 degree day. No, but like I've seen videos of people do it in four minutes, so surely. All right, well, I'm really excited. Do you have the keys? Obviously. Okay. All right, we made it. Here is all of our koala goodies. There's actually heaps of little boxes. So we've got, what's that? The queen mattress, king mattress, three seater couch. And then I don't know what this is. I think this is for the bed bases, but we're just gonna unload the car now. Oh my God, I haven't been in it. Hello. Oh my God, it smells new. Chuck the light. Oh, what's this? What the hell? What is that? What could this be? You know what it is? Here's the copy of mom. Storm grey couch. You're gonna push it back a little bit, maybe. I'll help. Ready? Go. Yep. And then ottoman. And then we'll probably have like a little coffee table here. Maybe a round one. I'm not sure. Do you reckon round would go with? Push this in a little bit more. Yeah, nice. It's actually a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Do you like it? Good. Yeah, nice. All right, let's do the beds now. We're like literally dripping with sweat. <laughs> I'm gonna take my glasses off, but yeah. First thing done and dusted. This is our kitchen. But I'm sure I'll show you guys that later on. What a self cleaning <laughs> oven, like what? <laughs> That's all I get. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go tackle the beds now. And yeah, I'll show you guys the bed. Oh, how cute is this? because we adopted a turtle. Cute.
Is it? Oh, is it? Oh, it's not even that heavy anyway. Wrong way? Wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Pull that plastic down. Yeah. Oh, it's light, eh? Oh my god, we got there in the end, we got these cute little koalas, because every time you purchase a mattress you adopt a koala, how cute, spare room done, okay we're not going to take the mattress out of the box from our one because we don't have a bed base yet, cuteness, and now we're going to tackle all that. So we just finished setting up the spare bed, the couch, and then I unloaded some of the glasses and stuff, but we need to go find a bed base. I think that's like top priority, because otherwise we can't sleep in the house until we um, get that. <laughs> um, we need to get linen if we find a bed base. Hopefully we can get the bed base straight away, but if we have to wait then so be it. And I'm hungry as well, so we might get something to eat. So we've just come to Furniture Gallery to have a look. Whoa. Look at all this, it's so nice. Look at this bed. Found this bed base. It's got um, storage here. Express delivery, this item is in stock and ready for delivery. Well, that's what we want. That one's so low though. Look how low that is. iPhone cables are shit. iPhone cables do. Hey guys, so it's now the next day. A little update on the house. We did spend quite a bit of time last night just taking all of our clothes and stuff. I hung up a few things, mainly like winter stuff in my walk-in wardrobe and that's just clothes that I've had in Perth for ages. I'm looking at getting like a little um, drawer, like chest of drawers here because I've got quite a bit of room at the back and yeah, it doesn't have inbuilt drawers. I've just got some of my active wear and then <laughs> this is Peter's one, which is a little bit smaller. He's hung up majority of his clothes, but that was just easy for him because he just brought it all in like on the coat hangers and then he just hung them up. Um, also, yeah, we still haven't got a bed frame. We're going to go back today and have a look at the ones that we saw yesterday. Here's our couch. Kitchen, still the same. Um, this is our little temporary fridge. It's just like a little like drinks fridge. Um, we got our HelloFresh delivered yesterday, so it's all in there. I want to go to Ikea today and get some um, storage for the pantry. Mum's um, coming on Wednesday, so we're going to do all of our cutlery and plate shopping. So we've just, like, for the meantime, just taken some from Peter's parents' house. Oh, my God, have I showed you these books? I bought them online. I think it was from Booktopia. But yeah, so cute for coffee tables. For now, we need to go and get a bed because we need somewhere to sleep. I've got my electrolytes here. I might actually bring another water bottle. We just need to measure out our room and we also need to measure out around the couch um, for a rug. And then we need to get a dining table. I'm not sure what to put in the corner there. Maybe like a little display sort of unit. We need to get like paintings for the wall. We need to put the TV on the bracket. We need a TV cabinet. We just got so much to do. But yeah, I'm just so excited to start setting up the house and start living in it. But yeah, I will update you guys if we find a bed today. So last night we got the measurements for the bed frame, but we didn't actually measure the room. And the bed frame is one meter. There. It pretty much takes up most of the back wall, which means we only have 
like realistically for bedside tables we would only have like half a meter again i guess we only really need small bedside tables i don't think we're going to get like drawer bedside tables so i do want to get like a chest to draw here or we were thinking the bed so this is the room i'll show you so as you walk in we were going to have the bed so the bed frame is on against that wall because there's two power points there for obviously like the lamps or charging your phone or whatever but i thought like it could have been cool to have the bed base sorry the bed frame against the um window so we have way more room in either side to get like bigger bedside tables but then i'm not sure what that would look like and i think we're going to replace these doors with mirrors because i don't really like it's kind of like a it's like a bluey color you can't really tell it's like a really pale mint green like i don't mind them but i'd prefer if they were mirrors i was going to put my full length mirror right here but i'm not sure if we're doing that anymore if we're gonna make those wardrobe doors into mirrors but i'll just put my full length mirror in my makeup room so with my drawers i'm gonna measure literally 1.26 yeah 1.26 meters high can't be any higher than that i could put like drawers here but that just means i can't hang clothes there you know so as i said earlier we are on a mish to find a bed base so yesterday we just went to furniture gallery um, Harvey Norman, Freedom, Amart, and this other one. But we found that the best ones were in Harvey Norman. They actually still have my bed base, lol. But um, they, the one that I liked is from Harvey Norman. There was another company called Kev's Beds, which is like, I don't know. To me, it's like a rip off, rip off of Harvey Norman. Um, but the dimensions of the actual bed head is smaller so meaning we'd have more room for the bedside tables but then again it's like so similar to the one that i had in my apartment and i kind of just want something a little bit different um and i love i'll show you guys when we go because we're probably going to go back to harvey norman just to suss out the exact dimensions of it like we'll bring our measuring tape and everything just in case the online measurements weren't as accurate but it's basically like my bed head at home but just a darker more charcoaly gray but it's like a velvet finish it just looks really really nice in real life um i can't remember if i did vlog it yesterday or not i don't think i did but we were literally bed shopping literally all day and we didn't eat until like like we had breakfast and then didn't eat till like 6 p.m like that's how busy we were um we just got a few um like kitchen stuff or we'll cook um a dinner our first dinner tonight at home so that should be fun um as i said my hello fresh arrived so we'll just cook a meal from that um we'll go to ikea because i saw online that they have really cute like um storage for the pantry and i really want to be as organized as i can um with this house i'm going to have all my pantry all organized i want to have like fridge storage i want to have like laundry storage and i want to also find like clear acrylic storage for my makeup room just for storage for that um so yeah that's the plans for today oh my god it is so hot <sighs> um so yeah I will obviously update you guys if we end up getting a bed. All right, we're back. We got that bed that I showed you guys and we went into Adair's and got this Duna cover. It's the duck feathered one. And we got a mattress protector. This one's just from Kmart. And yeah, we're just gonna air out the Duna cover. Hi guys, so it's now the next day. Our bed just got delivered. I'm super excited for Peter to come home and so we can set it up. But I'll obviously show you guys what the um, 
bed looks like, but it's just the same one that I said, the gray one. I've just been spending some time cleaning all of our kitchenware. We don't have a dishwasher yet because apparently the dishwasher just didn't work when we bought the house. So we've just removed that and we just got to go buy one. I really want to go into Ikea and get some storage. We didn't actually end up going yesterday because we were stuck in a dares for like an hour trying to figure out what linen we want. Um, $600 later, um, we got the bamboo cotton fitted sheets, um, a mattress protector, but I'm pretty sure I told you that yesterday. Um, but yeah, I'm in my freaking new house. Like what is life? Um, Mum comes tomorrow. So we're picking her up from the airport. Um, tomorrow night and then she's actually hired a car just because I don't, obviously don't have a car here Peter will be at work most of the week So me and mum are gonna go out and try and find a dining table We've got rugs on the way that I ordered online. So I got a rug for here and a rug for the bedroom I bought more of my stuff over. We still need um, towels we did get towels from Peter's parents house just to have for the meantime, but I've just bought another massive suitcase full of my stuff so i'm gonna go and put it on its hangers now this is the theater room i will definitely do a house tour when everything is all in and organized this i've just kind of spent the last hour or so sort of unpacking very slowly i do want to get storage for underneath here i want to get like um Dividers for this. I still need to clean this out before I fill it. The drawers. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to be as organized as I can. Um, we need to get like a shower caddy for up there. So yeah, I'm excited. I will show you guys what the bed looks like when we have assembled it. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Good morning, guys. It is the first morning in the new house peter was working today so he's already gone he went at like 6 a.m it's like nine o'clock and i had literally the best sleep ever how freaking cool is the bed so we were up last night until like 11 putting it together because it was so hard but i'll show you guys what it looks like Oh my god, it's so pretty and I ended up getting this blanket box because I just think it looks so nice. Um, I want a rug for underneath, like the bottom half, to go out like here. Um, my mirror is going to go there and then we're just going to shop for two small bedside tables. I want a chest of drawers here, I want some paintings, probably up there. Um, but yeah. There's my bed. That's the bed covers. It does look a little bit more blue. Hey, like compared to in the shop, it looks more gray. It looks more like a guy's bed, to be honest. But I do like the sheets. Like they're really nice. Um, but yeah, that's what the bedroom looks like so far. We're going to get more pillows. I'm, I love sleeping with a lot of pillows. So I probably need to get another four more. And then another four more pillowcases. Um... But yeah, how cute. It's like velvet, the headboard. Can't believe Peter even agreed to it. I was like, are you sure? Like, is it not too girly for you? He's like, nah, it's fine. I was like, okay. <laughs> so yeah. I was gonna go to the gym with Peter's sister, but I'm so sore from yesterday. We did body pump. Um, my mum's coming today, so tomorrow we're going to go out and get the rest of the stuff. We're going to go shopping for a fridge, dishwasher, dryer, um, and all of that fun stuff. Yeah.